Okay, welcome to Hitman 3. Um, as I said in the intro, I was feeling nostalgic because around this time last year, I was playing Hitman 2. And now that I have a little bit more um, game real estate, I decided to play this one. That and also there was a big announcement that they're doing a thing where they're giving you games 1 and 2. Uh, I had this in my inventory since last year, I think. Thank you, whoever gave me this. But um, I'm not here for the story. I'm not really here to take this game too seriously. I just really love the levels. I love doing dumb things in the game. It's just a lot of fun. And uh, I did carry over my content from Hitman 2. So, like I said, we're just going to take our time with this game. I'm not going to be rushing through it. And I'm also not... Um, I'm not really going to be paying too much attention to the story. I say that and then I know some chat members are going to want me to, but yeah, we'll just uh we'll we'll just play some missions and stuff. Wait, chat, isn't this Hitman 2? I mean, this is these are games from Hitman 2. Remember this stuff? I remember I was so excited I got the New York mission and then it was just inside of a bank the whole fucking time. Um, three is starts on Dubai. Oh, like Mission Impossible. I don't want to spoil the levels. I don't want to spoil them, but I want to show you my favorite levels from two. I actually like genuinely think about this game's levels sometimes where I'm just like, God damn, that was a cool fucking level. My favorites were, um, wait, why is Paris at 0%? Huh, I guess I could always play that. This is at 0% too. That's Hitman 1. Oh, no shit. I didn't realize that was also here. Well, my favorite levels in Hitman 2 were Miami. Whittleton Creek. Um, the Eyes Wide Shut Island times a thousand. I loved this level. And I like this one too. But they were all pretty good. Hitman 1 has some of the best levels. Well, we could always go back and play some. Like I said, just going to be playing for fun. Um... So, uh, a bald man goes to uh, Dubai. I don't remember how to play this. I don't even remember if I played this with a controller. In the shadows. Oh, it's Henrik. The everyday world. From uh, Dragon Quest XI. The lines and the seats of power. A hidden hand. Kind of company known as Providence. To it, we were just assets to use and throw away. That's sad. To do the unthinkable. That's so sad. <laughs> the unforgivable. And it never gave us a second thought. Until now. After decades in the shadows, we are fighting back. Me and 47. Much has been lost. His name is John 47. Closer than ever. We trapped the constant, Providence's chief controller, and finally learned the names of its three partners. Is this Bayonetta 3? The multiverse? Just we lay the past to quickly rest. montaging through locations? And just maybe look towards the future. 37. It's time. Hi. Right. It does start like a Christopher Nolan film, doesn't it? These guys making a James Bond game makes perfect sense. 
It does. The partners are down there. You know, I never planned this far ahead. You never do. I see someone got his memory back. TLDR, you're going after the three Super Illuminati members. Oh, fuck, the Super Illuminati? Illuminati Ultra. What the hell? Base. Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirmed target locations. Over. When did this game come out again? Right. We have a situation. Carlisle has left the building. And I think I know why. 2021. The Constant has escaped. He persuaded one of the sailors into setting him free. And since then, he's been seizing control of Providence assets and resources. I can only assume Carlisle The salty seamen set him free, huh? Damage. If she slips away again... We'll keep track of her. Make sure she doesn't. Meanwhile, the plan stays I'm the same. I'm not, not going to do the VR version of this. Accepted. Hell no. <laughs> I heard it was terrible. Our partners are laying low, courtesy of their host, Sheikh Omar Al-Ghazali. Marcus Stuyvesant is fifth generation old money. His family made its fortune in Oh, Stuyvesant. Banking. There's a uh, uh, New York Stuyvesant. Stuyvesant College is a powerful Washington kingmaker whose family grew rich selling gunpowder during the American Civil War and later established a globe-spanning empire in oil. Oh, this is the Super Illuminati, I see. Both families long since retreated from public view, but their quiet dominance endures to this day. Now, the partners likely suspect that we're coming. So I could get behind this. Infiltrate building controls and disable all electronic doors and elevators. Stuyvesant and Ingram are about to find they have nowhere left to run. Right. This is our moment, 47. Providence ruined our lives with the flick of a pen. Today, we return the favor. Happy hunting. Cut to a, a shot of a plane. Anyway, uh, yeah, I don't want to play the VR version. I hear it's very janky and very bad. And uh, I'm not interested, but I'll, I'll play this. So we got some targets here. You see them. Look. Oh, hey, yeah, you look at this guy. New York. Ah. Smuggled item. Gear. Oh, Chad, I can bring a gear with me. Oh, I can't carry additional equipment. That's fine. I'll just bring the wire. Um, yeah, this is fine. We'll do professional. That's what I did last time, last year. Lock picks are always good. Bring the fish, it's powerful. A secret load for later. Welcome to Dubai, 47. Today is the inauguration of the scepter. And the ceremony is well underway. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest You levels. probably don't want to be that close to the balcony. Mr. Gray is already in position and ready to assist. Doesn't seem like the safest location. Um, Chad, does anyone remember if I played this with a controller? <laughs> I'm here. I probably did, right? I mean, heading towards a point of entry. Good. Get back to me when you're there. Cool level so far. Just starting out here like this, like Tom Cruise. Vinny, you didn't? What's this? What are we doing here? Well, how do you guys play the game? Controller support in the game is solid. Mm, locked. Like Metal Gear Solid? Use your camera and scan the lock, will you? I think I can override the Windows controls from here. Thank you for giving me. I should have brought the damn fish. Chat's right. I should have brought the fucking fish. I 
I'm in position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans some. Well, understood. We need absolute focus on this one. Tis used. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. Didn't hit Whitman 3 VR win an award. Also, sorry that took me so long. I was doing a poo. Okay, good chat member. Thank you. Um, I think it did win an award, but I remember it being really panned and people were saying it was extremely jank. Well, this is a convenient place to be let out. Oh. Can we... Can we grab a suit? Oh! Oh, I get it. They, they were doing a thing. Here, let me, um... Let me... Um, people equals Vinny's mod and a reviewer. <laughs> Like, most of my chat at the time it came out was saying it wasn't so good. I watched a video. But if it's funny, it's funny. That's a different story altogether. Spectre? Wait, is this James Bond? I'm security. Look, look at me, I'm security. It's one of my favorite things about Hitman is just nonchalantly walking into an area you're not you supposed to be. Doing? You don't belong here. You, excuse me, I'm calling for help, just wait. Chad, I think I've already failed the mission. Do me a favor and see what that's about, would you? Hi, excuse me. I don't have a lockpick. I really, you know what? That would have been a good thing to bring. Have you just accepted that I work here now? Because I, I do. Are you? This is a restricted area. Oh, sorry, I'm leaving. So hold it right there. No, I'm leaving. No, I'm leaving. Wrong button. Wrong button. Oh, God, I have to learn the controls all over again. Oh, fu oh God, I really don't want to go all the way down. Okay. Chat, I can't climb back up. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm back up. How do you run? How do you run? Is there a way to run? I forgot all of this. Oh my god. I'm in position. 47, the inauguration is taking place close. I should have brought the fish. If you infiltrated it, get your bearings. I'm sure there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. We need here, look, we've got moves here. Um press camera shoulder. Run is oh, oh I see. Run. I see. If Ingram and Stuyvesant are alerted to our presence, we may lose them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. I got it now, chat. I got it. It's uh, no, no, no. The chat doesn't have to write it down. It's it's uh, L, regular L. It's it's not um, L R. It's L, regular L. But take the L. <laughs> I said that like that. Well, 
Oh, that's a shame. Body hidden. Mental. Thirty eighty is doing good. Uh, how is it looking for you, lads? Is, is it like full frames? Looks good. Yeah, the game seems to be pretty well optimized. Can I go here? I can. Oh, hello. I'm I'm staff. No, I'm not. Never mind. Kidding. <laughs> That's exceptionally good sushi. TikTok prank going behind bars and other places and acting like you belong. It's a real TikTok thing. Just acting like you belong is its own genre of, of thing. I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. If you can gain access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. We'll have to work together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. Um. Wow. Yeah, I mean, a whole year has gone by, so I don't, I don't really know what I'm doing, but you know, we'll get there. It's a hell of a starting mission. Damn. If only I had some poison. Oh, I need to use the toilet real quick. Good. Uh, do you have any um, cock porn? It's <laughs> funny. Oh, you can go. Oh, look at that. Sir, the toilet. The, the toilet is doing weird things. I have hacked the toilet. There. Ah. There you go. Stalls occupied. Oh, oh, hey, hey, Jim. No, 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 no. It's me. It's 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 me, um, Nate. It's, uh, uh, Nathab, Nathab, Nathab. I work here. Hello, I work here. See, I work here. It's fine. You know what? I think it would just be in my best interest not to throw a soda can at someone's face. M maybe not just yet. A bit of security here. One moment. You ready for some more fresh air, 47? Hmm.
This is better because it was um, not noticed. There you go. Oh, can we close? Yeah, there you go. Thank you. That's good. It's much better. Hello, I am a laundry detendant. <laughs> That's a fun word. Have you ever heard that word before? Sorry, were you, did you say something? Now I am what you would call security. Is there a camera options chat that you're aware of where you can like zoom out a little bit? <laughs> Press L plus ratio. That's funny. Uh, yes. Hello. It is I, security hey. tattoo head man. You? Good. Any news on the new guard signed a code name Pinky? I got word that he entered the building, but he Pinky. hasn't reported for duty yet. Wow. Probably still down at the depot, getting his uniform. I just hope he's got his papers with him. It's I heard rumors that he used to work for that Dowood Rangan. You know, the Bollywood producer who died. Doesn't sound promising. <laughs> nope, it doesn't. Stuyvesant is expecting a replacement guard. If you can locate him, we should be able to get within strangling distance of the little worm. <laughs> Incidentally, that's also what he calls his uh, pet worm. Isn't there a way to like get vision of like where the targets are? Yeah, there you go. Or one. I'm going to go here and I'm going to, um, I am going to find this guy and be his replacement security guard. It's going to be awesome. Hey, thanks. Hey, thanks. It's fine. Every, everything here is fine. No problem. Please step back, sir. We're not kidding here. I well, a higher level of security guard. Well, that's how it is. Think about it and come back if you want. I'll be waiting upstairs in the room. Who was this guy? I thought I was walking towards this guy. He's not here. Can you smack someone with a banana chat or do you have to throw it at them? <laughs> Just a normal day here at security. No problems here. Don't worry about me. Don't don't focus. Oh, this is bad. We don't want to be there. Someone just watch that. 
they're like, why is security doing this? Oh shit, I got a coconut too. If this is anything like the James Bond game is going to be, I have a feeling you're going to be able to like get like tactical uh, bananas. Now listen here, Devil Ace Tab, and this banana is actually an anal dildo. <laughs> <laughs> right, QIC. How do you want me to proceed with the mission? Hell if I know, 007. I don't know the code to the door. Oh, hey, uh, you don't recognize me, that's fine. You can place the banana on the ground to make people slip. Oh, sorry, I dropped my banana. Can, I, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, man, I just ended up back here. But now I have a banana, that's true. Crazy, right? No, it's a uh, chat. It's fine. They don't. They don't even know. Hey, calm down. What is wrong? You are going to be. Hey, that, that's not a muffin. There's some crazy guy in there throwing muffins. You should check it out. Four seven zero six. Come on, you copy. I want to. How do I wear this man's clothing? I need to wear the clothing. Hey, what's up? Hey, do I know you? Get in gear. Yep. You got a great arm, mister. Come on. <laughs> you got a great arm, mister. Am I going to have to load a save file? I guess now I am.
Oh, uh, this is before. Okay, hang on, hang on. Um, I think this is okay. What was your plan? Uh, shoot. Do you remember what you're supposed to do? Oh yeah, I, I remember. Four seven zero six. This is briefing four of the day. Most of the guests have arrived now. His Highness should be just about finished with his opening speech. This is where it gets real. The last nine hours have been a tutorial for what's coming now. You'll have some of the most important people in the world out there. Art critics, royalty, politics. Wait, what? This what? is where it gets real. The last nine hours have been a tutorial for what's coming now. You'll have some of the most important people in the world out there. Art critics, royalty, politicians, YouTubers, you name it. YouTubers? Oh no. Today. So that means new rules. Okay, before we go through those, I want to point your attention to the pile of papers on the table. It contains names and information of guests, the new terminal passwords fresh from IT, and run sheets for everything that's going to take place over the next three hours. Grab one before you leave. Memorize everything. All right, first things first. Remember your places. These are important people who do not need to be burdened by your presence. Unseen is a requirement. Second, you will overhear conversations of a sensitive nature. I don't believe I have to tell you that half of these people are rich beyond your wildest dreams. Rich means weird. Whatever you hear in the scepter will stay here. Understood? I didn't sign an NDA with the girth of... Wow. Excuse me. I think you forgot something. Oh, sorry. Second, you will overhear conversations of a sensitive nature. Girth? I don't believe I have to tell you that half of these people are rich beyond your wildest dreams. Rich means weird. Whatever you hear in the scepter will stay. Oh, I thought I said Spectre. Understood. Scepter. I didn't sign an NDA with the girth of Sheikh Omar's grandfather just to have one of you idiots call up the press with a news story. And finally, the food is for guests Hello there. only. Unless Hello there. There's no such thing as tasting. I think we all recall what happened at the grand opening of Sheikh Omar's solar panel plant last year. What's up? Nobody wore white for five months after that incident. Oh, one last thing. We've installed keypads on most of the doors here to keep raunchy guests from sneaking off to do their dirty business. You have no idea how filthy some oh. of these people can be. Filthy. Anyway, the code is 4706. Don't Alex, it's it. the code. And the music industry code. Any of the guests. That's an order. Don't screw up out there. I'm sure you all hold your lives dear, and I'd hate to report you to the Sheikh's family. Make me proud. Shake Shack. That's all. Wait, was I supposed to pick up one of these papers? No? Locate the missing recruit. Missing recruit here in... Ah, yes, rat poison. Hey, I need that real quick. Don't, don't mind me. How do you add rat poison to the muffin? Chat. There's a way to do that, isn't there? It's a different kind of poison. Oh. Well, the missing recruit, it doesn't seem to be in here. But yet, it keeps telling me to go in there. What? Get away from the creep. <laughs> Thumbs up, mate. Crazy. Here somewhere. Don't you worry. A colleague is also out there looking. Hey, you. I have a problem. I'm supposed to meet up for duty, but they can't find my uniform. That's not my problem. Come on, I need help. You look my size. If, if you're off duty, couldn't I just borrow your uniform? It's my first day and I really need this gig. Good for you. What? Sir, you dropped something. Good hey, for you. You. 
Congratulations. I have a problem. No, it's all screwed up. They can't find my uniform. I'm begging you, man to man. Sorry, still on duty. Oh, God. <laughs> this is not my day. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, I think you forgot something. Hey, you. I have a pro. Hey, hey. Excuse me. Looks like you. Hey, you. Wah. Oh, excuse me, sir. You dropped something. Hey, you. Wah, wah, wah. Sir, you dropped something. Hey, you. I have a problem. I'm supposed to meet up for duty, but they can't find my uniform. That's not my problem. Come on, I need help. Hey, don't throw the... What? Could someone please help? Uh. Um, are these lockers not good? Oh, you can't. Oh. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. We're good. We're good. He just, his body just did something weird. Dump. That's my frying pan. I'm still learning the controls, chat, so, so please bear with me. I'm trying to figure out how to play this fucking game. All right, so um, present yourself at the security office. Wait, what's your deal? Security office is upstairs. I'm ready. I'm ready to protect. Oh boy. Oh God. It's all the way over there. Vinny, I just bought the Rem Lazar hat in Blu-ray. That's um that's cool, but you know I don't I don't get a kickback from that, right? Hello, sir. Technically, Jack bought me a drink and invited me to the premiere of his movie, so I guess I'm okay with that. That that you know what? That's fine, chat member. I, I don't I don't harbor any ill will that I don't receive any money per DVD sold. It's fine. Vinny, I just pirated the first season of Vine Sauce. Did you really? You... Where'd you find it? On YouTube? Your boss seems pretty interesting. Reporting for duty. About time. Our client has been going out of his mind waiting for you. Do you have the papers? Yes. Good. I'll call him now. How should I address him? It's classified. So, you don't call him anything. But officially, he's just known as codename Pinky. Sir, this is security. Winky. Wait yes, for Marcus in the security office. Okay. Well, I guess we'll wait. I'm gonna need that key, of wait course. Here. He'll be here shortly. Just a heads up. The package is a real ball breaker. Hey! Right there. Okay. That's Marcus Stuyvesant. Providence partner, self-entitled, and I arrogant very little high standards. I trust You might not look like duty. much. I will do my I duty. To the world than you could dream. Looking good today, sir. Well, this all looks very promising. Yes. Good. Oh, you worked for Darwood Rangan. Hope you weren't there on the day of his tragic death. I remember that name. Okay. Yeah, I was there so on the day of his tragic death. Good. Okay, walk with me. I need to go through some ground rules. This guy wearing... Wait, what is he wearing? Like sandals with 
backs? Is there a name for this type of shoe? I expect you to be by my like, side uh, is it a douche seven. shoe? And as I say otherwise, bathroom breaks are of course permitted, but only when I say so. I have a very important and delicate meeting today in which I expect you to keep your ears closed, but your eyes wide open. Understood? Now, you blew that guy off the side of a building with a massive fan. Oh, I remember that. That's who that was. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, can, yep. Your papers were indeed impressive, but I need to see what you can do with my own eyes. My father used to take me hunting. He was an avid hunter. I personally hated it. Those pop brownies. His skill with a knife and grew to appreciate what it takes to gut an animal. Ooh, that would have been fun. Yes. Good. Have him walk onto that. You know, it's not so easy. Electrocution death. Like trying to stab a rubber ball. Are there any giant okay, fans over this way? There. You see the shooting targets? Any fool can shoot a target. With a knife? No. That's where the talent lies. My Wait. father always used to say, if you open with a knife, you're even better with a gun. I want to see your skills. What about with a banana? I lie, but I've always trusted a man who can throw a knife. <laughs> I'm sure a psychiatrist would have a field day with that statement. So, show me what you got. And you work for me. Fail, you get out of here, and I never want to see your face again. That's just to be as half as good as you were. Only now, isn't there a way to see like bonus objectives, like challenge? Yeah, challenges here. Headshot, accident, pushing, dumping, or pulling him over a ledge. I'm Will Tell. I got that lock on. How do you like that shit? Magnificent performance. I like you. I think we will get along just fine. You've gained his trust. Please. What to Please do space. with all that yeah. power? Okay. I think I got the right man now. Thank you for your services. You take the rest of the day off. You deserve it. Thank you, sir. It was an honor. Sorry, my hand slipped. I am here in What the fuck? <laughs> Sorry, I want you to stay close, but not too close, especially when we are out in public. If you see a man with a bodyguard, it draws attention. Understood? Yeah, of course you do. Come on, follow me. No. You got him, 47. Marcus Stuyvesant won't be a problem anymore. Let's move on to Carl Ingram. We're not done yet. That's right. I still have one more banana. Sparta! Hmm. I also have a coconut. Two coconuts and, and a banana. Where, where is this daffy fuck? Coconuts are deadly? Oh, even better. His coconut gun shoots in spurts. If he hits you, it's gonna hurt.
Stop right there. Now let go of the body, nice and easy. Moving in on surrender, the, the gun. You hit. I'm calling for help. I need help. I'm right fucking now. How do I drop the body off the fucking ledge? more an Arlo impression than uh, Peter Griffin. That's the only, like, I can only do an impersonation of Arlo if it's him going, eh. I'm saving the coconut. Because I don't, I don't want to use it unless it's a kill shot on the other, you know, the other guy. Ah, oh, damn. Ty, is there a way to get that down? Can I shoot that or something? Oh, it's non-lethal? Well, that was a dumb idea. Crowbar from above. Okay. Let me not act suspicious here and let me actually try to do this mission now. How are you? Oh, I'm doing just fine, thanks. Just a harp in a hallway. Did they just hire someone to play hallway harp? Yeah. Why? Just wondered if you got the briefing on the lockdown drill tomorrow. I got it. Requested no noise of any kind. Okay. But it means I'll work slower. I don't care what tempo you work. It will be slow. And I'll probably get a warning about that. I think I'm in love. How much of priceless life were spent with men that every virtue decks and women models of their sex? society's true ornament air we dare wander nights like this let's go ahead and take that thanks how does agent 47 hold all this stuff does he have a link pouch wait did this dude's voice change it, it did prison pocket <laughs> Oh, that that drink is the good shit now. God, these guys are ev everywhere. This does have RTX on, yes. RTX on. Beautiful. Garlic, couscous, macaroni, nuts, cereal. Are you kidding me? No, it needs to simmer for perfection. It must stop. And who might you be? I'm. Because I don't know you. No, hey. that's suspicious. I am just a part time, like, chef. It's a hobby. It's a hobby. To 
find a way to... Oh, fuck, this is the toilet. Um, I have to find a way to, to do a thing here. Is this egg? Destructible? No. That's Carl Ingram, Providence partner and partner. billionaire. A legendary political fixer, Ingram is old money and as rotten as they come. Great. Um, well. Oh, he's going to eat poisoned food. I wouldn't mind getting him to eat some poisoned food. already poisoned a drink earlier, so yeah, I, I wasted some of my poison. Uh, Vinny, you need to be become a chef. Hitman can really change into different clothing very quickly. You, you you. It's raw. No. God, you didn't even de shit the shrimp. Oh, that's full? Ah, shit. Um, damn, and people pass through here, too. Hang on, there was a there was a shitter somewhere around here. Where, where was the shitter? How do you drop an item? Oh. I am just a normal Chef 47. Oh god, the Fabergé egg is fucked! Call Ingram to let him know the food is ready. Well, I need some poison. Pick up meaty bone. There's a really, hang on, there's a really entertaining kill here, says a chat member. If you position 47 in a specific way between the shelf and the ice maker, you can self su So does anyone know where the poison is? Just looking for that poison. It's here somewhere, I know. Didn't you get the rat poison? Uh, I may have misused it. It's gone now. Try the kitchen poison counter. Yeah, I checked. I didn't see anything in there. There was poison on the counter right there. Poison is stored in the balls. <laughs> that's So that's why they say you got to get the poison out.
There's no poison up here. It said poison. Oh, like, yeah, no, that said poison because it means, like, you're going to poison the glass. Um. You have to suck the poison out. All right, chat. I see what we're doing here. We're being, we're being silly. No one wants to tell me where the poison is. Everyone's telling me about self-sucking. And, uh, other things. Disgusting, unhinged, depraved things. That's fine. Reload the save. No, it's much too late for that. I know there's poison here somewhere. Well, that worked out nicely. Yeah. Uh, oh no. Uh, I don't feel so good. Oh shit. Wow. That was amazing timing. Walter, I gotta I gotta shit now, Walter. Oh no, is he gonna go in the bathroom? The, is he gonna go in the bathroom with the body in it? I'm a chef, motherfucker. This is what I do. God damn it. God damn it. If the door wasn't open... If the door wasn't open, it would have been fine. He's doing it again. Chad, he's doing it again. <laughs> hide the body. I don't know where to hide the body. I, I have no idea what to hi where to hide the body. Body found. Oh, fuck. We got him 47. Soon there will be no more Providence. You need to find an exit. Our business is done that? here, but it's far from over. Nothing. Control Roger. Figure zero one. Not suspicious at all. Huh? What? Huh? Don't waste my time. That that is so fucking lame. There's explosive golf balls. See if I care. <laughs> Elite heat, hot one, toothpick, waiter cater, here goes nothing. Heat it, scepter. Hold my hair so it hurts themselves for a Where's Where's the. Do I get extra points for having drowned him in a toilet? Because I would award myself extra points for that. Oh, 
Oh, that's what that. Okay, got it. And then you can, for those that don't play Hitman, you can actually play the mission again and kill them in different ways. And you can, you know, unlock like hidden item stashes. Um, there's other things that you can get in the levels that increase your score as well. It's kind of fun. Makes you want to go back and replay levels. I'd hate to see you lose. We underestimated the constant. Yeah, he's a glorified desk clerk. He's not just after the money. He wants it all. He's not just after the money. once, we can do it again. And, well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. I don't like executive decision makers. Look, you don't have to follow her, you know? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about Faces are not matching with the voice. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. If the ICA knows what you did, she'll make it right. She always does. We have a fix on Carlisle. Come on. We've got a plane to catch. I hope you like the rain, 47. How did you... I have everyone's number. You really ought to know by now. You planned this. All of it. Don't be silly. I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. You had me. Where'd that get you? This looks like the mom from Beetlejuice a little bit. It's Catherine O'Hara. The partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. Providence can be an no, not really. change. Surely you understand. Or you will. Soon enough. Shake, 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 Sonora. Shake your body line. You mean the mom from Home Alone? Same thing. Yeah, so you un like actually as you're doing the story, you you uh, can get different. Like if you go back to the mission, you can actually get different pieces of story that you may have missed. It's kind of cool. Like there's completely different little sub missions. So each each time you play, you can get something different until you're done. Yeah, this this game, this whole series has insane replayability. Very addictive gameplay, too, because it makes you want to just keep re redoing the missions to try different things. She came home. Carlisle's lost an empire. You fall hard enough, and you tend to be reminded of what truly matters. So, the end of the line. You ready for this? How are you? Who will you be without a score to settle? Deep. I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. Alexa Carlisle is dead. According to the funeral invitation, that is. So naturally, it caused quite a stir when the late matriarch turned up at the breakfast table, alive and kicking. Carlisle, Crazy. wisely sensing that her number is up, has emerged from exile to tie up loose ends and secure the Carlisle legacy. She may be a monster, but you have to admire her due diligence. Carlisle descends from an ancient line of warrior aristocrats. Her great-grandfather made a killing in the Second Opium War and <laughs> established an empire in shipping, railroads, and newspaper publishing. While largely unknown to the public, the family still asserts its quiet dominance over global transport and logistics, media, and technology. Most senior of the partners, Alexa Carlisle, is cold as ice, tough as Alexa, nails, fart for me. sharp as a razor. Incidentally, it was her late father who first brought the three families together Alexa, the stop. Two at this very house, meaning that this gentleman is the birthplace of Providence. 
It began here, and it ends here. Talk about poetic. One more thing. According to our intel, Carlyle keeps a case file on the Constant. Information that may be helpful in his recapture. So don't leave the estate without it. Right. Happy hunting, 47. That's like the so administrator from fucking Team Fortress 2. Yeah, that's what it does when you ask it to fart. It can do that. I won't tell it to turn off your lights, chat. Wait, what is it loading? Ah. Connecting to the online servers. Connecting to the online servers, calling Mr. Herman. Paging Mr. Herman. Mr. Herman. Someone said to do uh, the main mission. It's a good one. Thornbridge Manor. The Carlisle family's home for countless generations. Oh, I love the love the look of this area. Oh, this is this is awesome. And her three adult children, younger brother Zachary, grandson and daughter-in-law, are all gathered to conduct Carlisle's sham funeral. Curiously, it's a who done it. It's knives out. Miss London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. Now, the target knows that you're coming and her guard detail is top notch. So Mr. Gray will secure their nearby field HQ and intercept all calls going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen. <laughs> oh, look, it's jolly old. Isn't this where James Bond had to defend his family home? Hello, yes, I am a guest at this residence. I am English. I grew up in Bristol. Phineas Whitmer, private investigator. I have an appointment with Madame Carlyle. Please wait. Mr. Mr. Whitmer is here to see Madame Carlyle. You can go right in. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator. It literally is nice knife, knife Carlyle this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe knife you knives to do some detecting yourself 47 a famous private investigator summoned by alexa carlisle has arrived at thornbridge manor if you take however will they stop people from coming into this place Well, shit. I don't know where to drag the fucking corpse. Or, well, it's just... It's not a corpse yet. Am 
No, this isn't the worst spot for it. Hello, yes. It is I. Uh, what are they called when you cut bushes? L Landscaper 47. Groundskeeper 47. <laughs> I don't know, I just felt like I needed that. Hey, how are you? Yeah, we have a uh, you are trespassing. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, and don't come back. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, I work here by the way. Oh well. The fish is mightier than the saber. With oh, a secret, secret place. We should get rid of this fucking sword if it's going to cause this many uh, many problems. Golf club, saber, intel item. A list written by Mister Fernsby, the butler, details various preparations for tomorrow's pretend funeral and a photo shoot scheduled for today by the fountain in the garden. Mansion Master Key. Oh, burnt that diary. That be a half-burned diary belonging to Zachary Carlyle. It says he and Madame Carlyle murdered their older brother 46 years ago, and that Mr. Fernsby helped them cover it up. He was planning to confess it all. Interesting. Well, I'm going to need someone to give me a better outfit. It's like planting seeds that will grow into telling actions or words. Took that dude a long time to get through the foyer. The foyer. Well, however the fuck you want to say it, chat. Foyer. If that is all, sir, please do come and find me if you're ready to inspect the crime scene. Just one question. Is that burned leather I can smell on you? Unusual for a butler to burn leather. I don't I, I don't know what you what you Seeds, Mr. Fernsby. Seeds. I would imagine you can just put on that dude's outfit and then be the detective. I've made a terrible mistake. Like that. 
I was telling you to wear the outfit. The entire mission is built around doing it that way. Knock him out in the bush at the start before he enters the gate. Oh, is that really... Is it more fun that way? Is it too late? Like, can I still knock him out and play that way? That's the that's a fun way to do it. Well, I thought maybe eventually I'd be able to get the outfit. It's worth restarting. Well, yeah, I can I can do that. But uh, first, I'm just going to try it like this. I'm going to see if I can become the private. The private eye. The private dick. here to deliver the fish. And right in front of me, a greenhouse. Indeed. Can somebody help me? Please, someone help me over here. If you're dressed like a Detective 47, you might as well ask the detective. I want to do it this way. Thornbridge Manor. I wouldn't call this backseating. I would call this inspiration. This is a private area. Phineas Whitmer, private investigator. I have an appointment with Madam. Um, should I kill these guards or, like, Mr. Whitmer is here to see Madam Carlyle. You can go right in. That is Phineas Whitmer, the famous I I private probably... investigator hired by Madame Carla this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Maybe you should do some detecting yourself, 47. What was that? Did someone brap? Maybe like right over here, like on the bridge? Okay, I don't think that was the way to do it, chat. Um, there's got to be a better way to do this. Should have had the coin. The Carlisle family's home for countless. Make noise with coins. I don't. I don't have any coins, chat. Maybe there's a way. Like, can I pick up another uh, apricot or something? I have an appointment with Madame Carlisle. Are those ducks? Oh shit, ducks! Dak soup. <laughs> I don't know why I said that like that. Uh, I have an idea, chat. Shit. That yeah. is Phineas Whitmer, the famous private investigator hired by oh. Madame Carla this morning. I'm curious why he's here. Excuse me, you really Maybe should... you should do some detecting yourself, 47. Hey, that worked. Well, wow, these people really don't see this. They really, really didn't see that.
Wow. Mr. Whitmer, thank God you're here. Can I take you to Madame Carlyle? Yes, please. If you'd follow me. Yep, this definitely. That's the famous British no, detective. I say anything, but I'm so relieved you're here. Everything's just so strange. Preparing for Madame's funeral, and then she turns up alive. But then the awful business. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, sorry. Sir, please take your belongings with you. Yep. Go ahead. No, I oughtn't say anything, but oughtn't. I'm so relieved you're here. Everything's hey, just so doing? strange. Preparing for Madame's funeral, and then she turns up alive. But then the awful business with her brother Zachary, and and all this security. I've never seen the place Looking guarded good, like this, and and, good. and I dare say I don't like Listen, it at all. Sir, no this drama. is what I mean. You, you have, have to be patted down before answer. you see Madame Carlyle inside. Oh, I could just cry. What's that? Yeah, you want you want to check my uh, my inventory? Sure. This is just standard procedure. Thank you. Sir, I will have to pat you down if you want to come through. Security measures. Uh, didn't we just do that? <laughs> Vinny, you're acting fishy. No. Sir, if you want to come through, I'm going to have to pat you down. First time was for job, second time is for fun. This, uh, this will be over in no time. Good. You are clean and good to I love the way he just pulls the fish out. Mr. Whitmer, thank you for coming on such short notice. A great tragedy has fallen upon us, and I need a quick resolution. Where are you looking? With absolute discretion. Results and discretion are my speciality. Very well. I suppose you will want to start at the crime scene. In my experience, a thorough examination of a potential crime scene is half the job done. Good. Fernsby will take over from Could they have found a more perfect voice actor for this dude? Madam Carlyle has asked me to assist you in any way possible. Mr. Whitmer, I understand that you've traveled from London. Would you care for some refreshments? Or do you prefer to go straight to Mr. Zachary's sleeping quarters? I prefer to get started. As you wish. If you'll follow me, sir. If you fish. I mean, wish. Don't question the fish. I feel obliged to point out that current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that the staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. Madam's children were not informed scheduled. this morning that their mother was in fact not dead at all. So please bear with them if they seem affected by the rather unusual situation. I trust I do not need to remind you that there will be consequences if word gets out that Madame Carlyle is still alive. Carlyle. I her dead when I leave. <laughs> Before you inspect the crime scene, I will tell you this. The case concerns the death of Mr. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. He was found dead in his bed this morning. The door was locked from the inside and a suicide letter was found in his room. However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play and will not accept that he took his own life. I've prepared some information for you, so please do come and see me when you've finished your investigation of the crime scene. This is Mr. Zachary's room, to my right. Okay, but what's in this room? Oh, I'm trespassing. Nice gropics. Yes, 
I'm still here. It doesn't exist. What do you mean it doesn't exist? What do you mean? What do you mean? A locked room murder mystery 47. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. This isn't a who done it, it's a what do you mean? Let's put some fish on the record player. Just jam out to some psych rock. 10 minute guitar solos. Zachary's suicide note. I am haunted by horrible past choices and their all-consuming consequences. Alexa. Was the raft keeping me afloat? Without her, I cannot go on. Goodbye. Also, a sample of handwriting. It could be relevant to compare to other samples to establish... Uh oh, Zorn. Zachary was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. You know, I find the crime scene to be rather fishy. Oh no, fish! No, 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 fish! Why don't you use your camera to scan the dead body, 47? No, I need to find a thing to throw at the fish so I can un un uh, get it unstuck. I will actually load the game just to make sure that I don't lose the fish. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. Zachary's suicide note. Also, a sample of handwriting. It could Essential be gear. compared to other samples to establish its authenticity. See, I want to... All right, fine. I'll save the game before I throw the fish. Zachary was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. Why don't you use your camera to scan the dead body, 47? Thank you, Hacker Raid. I, um, Hacker for the Raid. Throat markings. A bit fishy. A rare, short -lived Agent 47, you've made that joke several times. Fuck you. Shows time of death at around 10 o'clock last night. You do know your poisons, 47. Oh, God, really? A hidden library? It's a secret passage. This could explain how the door was locked from the inside. I guess if you're going to do a mission like this, you kind of have to do this, right? Keep the hole. Copy of the floor plan. Somebody's been researching the secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. I believe you've done a thorough search of the crime scene, 47. Maybe it's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. Butler. That's right, you're watching, you're watching very um, immature entertainment for mature adults.
witch.tv slash vine sauce. That's where you're at right now. Sir. Hey. Say what? Excuse me. Sorry, I dropped my I fish. You forgot something. Have you watched Columbo? What? No. That was a little bit before my time. I know Columbo has become a bit of a meme lately, but no. I didn't watch Columbo. I said the most random fucking shit becomes memes, I swear to God. Didn't Columbo run until 2003? I mean... Uh... I guess I was 18 in 2003. You know, I think I was the target market for Columbo at that time. Just wait a few days. I'm sure it'll sort itself out. Oh, stop pacing, for God's sake, Emma. Look, why don't we get any kind of explanation? It's bloody rude, that's what it is. Making us come here to play funeral and then show up like nothing's the least bit strange. Oh, don't get your knickers all twisted. I'm telling you, she's not fit to be in charge anymore. Okay. Okay, stay put. Stay put, newspaper fell from the ceiling again. It's all right, it's happened last week. An old house. I should get back to pin in it. Yeah. Right, yeah. Sorry. Absolutely nothing going on here. sure you focus on your work. I will. I don't need one more maid crying in the kitchen. So watch yourself around here, Mr. Patrick. Don't worry about me. It's a very American maid. Still looking for the damn case file. So I'm an American and I live in Scotland, says a chat member. Well, I just got Insta proven to have egg on my face. Do you think in, there's such a thing as an Englishman in New York? Bust. <laughs> They're going to enjoy the spectacle. The spectacle. Vinny tracks the This area is a restricted area and I can't let you in. Well, I'm a detective. Uh, all right, hang on. Uh, it could be anywhere. Chat members. Use the right bumper. Well, that's not going to show me where the damn case file is. Verify 
got his identity. I did, sir. It all checked out. Greetings, sir. Imagine living in this house alone. But like just the tremendous amount of money that you need to even like you need a sp you need more people to work here than live here. He gave me his coat and all. Rosie, you need to forget about Patrick. No good's going to come of it. Stick to your own kind. You mean like Chris? He treated me like shit. All he wanted to do was play his stupid video games. Never any what? romance. I deserve romance. What game is that? Like, wasn't there a game called Romancing Saga or something? You, I can get you that game. Me, detective man here. Okay, you want romance? Well, check your steam. I just got you orc massage. <laughs> Zachary's diary. This is big. He was about to confess to the world that he and Alexa murdered their older brother Montgomery 46 years ago. Can't have and that. Apparently, Mr. Fernsby helped make the murder look like an accident. Painkiller. And 47. Lethal. The handwriting doesn't match the suicide letter in his room, proving he didn't write it himself. But not the poison used to kill Zachary. Of course, Madame Carlyle doesn't know that. Are you considering to frame the butler, 47? Mm. Well, I first I'd like to find the goddamn case file, but uh, um, where is the butler anyway? Feel the hair on my neck stand. You have a way with words, Stan. You're not going to find the case file walking around. It's part of the story. Okay, gotcha. Thank you. I don't mind the back seating a little bit, especially if I'm, you know, asking for help or if I'm like specifically lost. Turn on your mission story notification. Why was that not on? Oh, that one. There you are. I was looking for you. Mr. Fernsby, I'm done with the crime scene. Did you establish a time of death? Zachary died around 10 o'clock last night. Well, that means the staff were off duty. And Madame Carlyle and her security didn't arrive until this morning. That leaves Madame's family and myself as the only persons here when he died. And before you ask, no, I do not have an alibi. I was alone in my office at the time. Of if day. I was like a director, this would be the shot I would do. It's a list of the possible suspects and their quarters. Hopefully that will help you keep track of your findings. Please come and see me when you've solved the case. And I will take you to Madame Carlyle. And I'd move the camera like that when he spoke. And then back to him when he spoke. To convince Madame Carlyle like that. Maybe you should tell him you are ready to present your findings. So how does one solve a murder mystery, 47? How are you today, Motive, sir? means, and opportunity, I believe. May I suggest you ask the suspects for alibis? Or perhaps you prefer searching the manor for clues first? Unless, of course, you want to do some more detecting, 47? I mean, we got it pretty much figured out. I think solicitors are mother's favorite kind of people. Can't remember ever having a family of Gregory Carlyle. Would you mind taking you a few steps away from me, please? <laughs> so you're wondering about my alibi, Mr. Detective. Well, um, this I reminds me of the mansion from Violet Knight. Half eight, 
for a pint with Edward. I wish I hadn't. <laughs> Quiz night at the inn. On the other hand, staying here with Zachary, my obnoxious sister, and the wife sporting another one of her headaches would have been a fate worse than death. <laughs> the, the short of it, Zachary was very much alive when we left. I stayed for the last shout, and I was back here just before midnight. Is that all? Not very thorough, are you? Oh, yeah. Tell me about Zachary. Zach? Huh. Such a sad old sod. A bit heavy on the bottle. But who could blame him? The only company he had was his rare plants and mother, who travels more than she stays here. Honestly, I can't say which is the bigger ball. He's better off dead. Anything else you want to pry from my intricate intellect? Anything else you'd like to tell me? Nothing, really. I'm just enjoying the show. Our perfect mother obviously fucked up, didn't she? Faking her own death. You know, she's explained nothing to us. I think she's scared to own up to her own mistake. You're giving me a bit of anxiety, sir. <laughs> I think solicitors are mother's favorite. Whoa! People. Whoa! I can't remember ever having a family event what? without one tucked away in a room somewhere. How does this always happen with me? Always trumped the family. I think he's here to cut us from her will. Very ridiculous. Imagine the scandal if the firstborn <laughs> son didn't pick up the torch. That would never happen. Emmer Carlisle, can you tell me where you were this <laughs> evening? Surely I'm not a suspect. <laughs> I need to account for everyone. Well, I spent the evening with my family, but I got an awful migraine and had to take to bed. Everyone can attest to that. Man, I'd be a great I cinematographer. I sat down for a drink around eight o'clock. Is that all? How did you feel about Zachary? I might as well be honest. His presence was always awkward. But how do you have a meaningful conversation with a man who only cares about plants? Talk about In my plants. Opinion, Alexa bears some responsibility for how this ended. She supported his self-limiting behavior by letting. She says him his presence was awkward. And meanwhile, is floating. Have you noticed anything else out of the ordinary? Nothing special comes to mind, except perhaps I did get a feeling that Zachary was depressed, not just sad. I suppose he realized that he had no one. I'm sorry, Alexa Chad. I'm just. On. Even Alexa must feel the pangs of guilt over that one. Letting him believe I'm doing camera dead. movements. That's all, chat. Again, I'm keeping uh, dynamic and fluid. Uh, that's all I'm doing is keeping it fluid. Okay, great. Well, I think I know who killed him. It's probably the witch. <laughs> Anyone who can hover may be a little bit suspicious. Again, huh? Did you want to check on that undertaker in charge of the funeral? I got word he's upset with Madame Carlyle. Everything's in order. Would you like a tea and a nappy? Use a trash can, sir. Will you drop the knife? Understand? 
I dropped it. I'm taking you with me. No, I dropped it. Oi, you need to discard that thing in your hand. Right fucking now. <laughs> I dropped everything. It's time to drop. Are you insane? Shoot I just needed a little chaos, chat. I just needed a little chaos. Tells me to drop the knife. I drop the knife and then says he's going to arrest me. something sir what uh, excuse me i think you forgot something hey you give it up right now i don't want to hurt you but hey you Vinny, I think that was a red herring. Uh, I don't think this fish is a herring. Chat members making up shit. That is the door to Rebecca's room. Well then, let's hope I get a chance to open that without much hassle. Ah, yes, incriminating evidence. Beautiful. I can see from the log that Rebecca was in a conference call from 9 p.m. to midnight last night. Man, Hitman is so intuitive. He knows where all the secret passages are. He's so cute. I love him. <laughs> Hitman is so cute. <laughs> this fucking voice is morphed into. Yes, I'm in England now. It's, it's all gone. Ron and I have been briefed about shit. What the fuck do I say to Carlisle? I feel completely blindsided here. I have no idea what's going on. It's it's all gone. No, she's calm as ice. It's it's just not natural. Nobody's that calm. It's gonna end in murder. I'm telling you. Are are you my brother? Are they keeping that statue over here? Sir, you are trespassing. You need to follow me right now. No. Shit. Mission story failed. That's such nonsense. <laughs> such nonsense. I can't even investigate without someone um, staring down my back. You came out of a secret passage. I didn't build the secret passage. That is the door to Rebecca's room. I can see from the log that Rebecca was in a conference call from 9 p.m. to midnight last night. She was also eating tea and drinking crumpets.
Well, I thought it was funny. Hey, Ron, did Yates mention anything about the Carlisle account? It's all gone. Ron and I haven't been briefed about shit. What the fuck do I say to Carlisle? I feel completely blindsided here. I have no idea what's... Huh? That guy now believes in ghosts. There will soon be ghosts in your living room. I'm ready to present my conclusion. Very well. Let's talk in my office. Am I not ready to present the conclusion? I'll try anyway. Hi there. This is the forbidden attic. I like how they have the fucking Baratheon crown. They're, they're Baratheons. The what? Uh, it's, it's a thing. It's a Baratheon. Bar Baratheons? Your detective skills have gained you access to the lion's Lord. den, 47. Now, go claim your reward. So, Mr. Whitmer, you've reached a conclusion. Take a seat. Please, go ahead. The butler, Mr. Fernsby, killed Zachary. Fernsby? Oh, you've got that wrong. He would never do such a thing. He is the most loyal man I have ever met. I found pills in his office that matches the poison that killed your brother. Furthermore, I found Zachary's notebook, half burned. Mr. Fernsby's fireplace. It showed that Zachary intended to publish a written confession to a murder the two of you committed nearly 50 years ago. The murder of your older brother, Montgomery. That's outrageous. We did no such thing. No need to feign innocence. I know a killer when I see one, and my discretion is assured. The papers also described how Mr. Fernsby helped you stage the murder of Montgomery as an accident. I believe he killed Zachary not to be exposed as an accomplice to murder. Sweet Fernsby. You are wrong, Mr. Whitmer. He did not do it to protect himself. He did it to protect the Carlisle legacy. Mr. Fernsby, like myself, understands that sacrifices must be made to secure stability and prosperity. Mr. Whitmer, I'd appreciate it if your findings never leave this room. I understand Fernsby's actions, and there is no need for them to have more consequences than they already have. Fernsby was very fond of Zachary, and I am sure his decision will haunt him to the day he dies. About your reward, have you considered an amount? I want the file you have on Arthur Edwards. Arthur Edwards? The Constant? But that must mean you're... <laughs> <gasps> I expected you'd show up. But you're not here to... should have known... When I saw the barcode right. on the back of your head. You already. The enemy of my enemy, I suppose. You can have it. You earned it. I thought she was going to press a button and I was going to fall into a pool of sharks with lasers on their faces. Hello, sir. The file you want is in the safe. 
Good. Good. <laughs> you know what? I'm glad I interrupted her. Good. Work, 47. Please That's the file on Arthur Edwards secured. No. Well, Time well, to take well, care of Madame Carla. Where are you going? Please, sit down. Right. Where were we? The file you... Want is in the safe. Good hunting. Good. I need some privacy. Thank you. Guess I'll just uh, step on out here. Mission complete. Well done, 47. How smart was that? Can anyone please help me? Oh, hello, sir. Well, nice to see you. Good lad. Is there a bonus for killing Fernsby? Missing propane flask? Uh, this is Carlisle? Come, come on! Do you need assistance, Potato servers. You framed Fernsby? <laughs> Wait, it wasn't him? That was a frame job? It seemed so good. There were three, there were two other options. Hey, how are you? Doing great. Your voiceover literally said you would be framing him. Oh, I probably was throwing a fish around when that was happening. having a laugh, dear. Must admit, he's pretty good. What if he believes we had something to do with Zachary's death? Oh, please. <laughs> That's my word. <laughs> this is Alpha One Actual. Aren't you supposed to be doing your job? Help! Somebody help me! <laughs> <laughs> All right, time for me to leave. I'm ready to present my conclusion to Madame Carlyle. Wait, wait, what? If you'll follow me, sir. Oh boy, is he going to be disappointed. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Why? I thought it would be funny to punch someone on the way out. I don't know. Uh, shit. Where did I last save? God damn it. Mission complete. Kill unnoticed. Wait, what is that icon? I dig this place. Ancestral graveyard, trophy room, 
And the office safe is hidden behind a portrait <laughs> with a secret right. mechanism for uncovering it. Yeah. It's got real soul. First time here. Yep. Yeah, it's impressive, all right. That's good to talk about when some random dude is standing behind you. Very smart. Uh, Mrs. Carlisle? Do you need assistance, ma'am? I, I, I... Is this not her office? Private room. Oh, this is like a... Oh, no, I don't like this room. This is where, like in Casino Royale, when James Bond gets his ghoulies obliterated by a rope. Where's that secret mechanism? I want to find the secret thing. Oh, I already got it. Oh, that was before. I thought there was another secret picture. <laughs> I swear, I'm I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm not I'm not like getting dementia or anything. It's fine. I just did. <laughs> oh no, I'm compromised now. Shit. Time to go to work. Six moving in a possible enemy target. Over. What? It's just a fish. Oh, give me a break. Suspicious fish crimes. What? She said you're coy and a coy immediately appeared. I get what you did there, but it's not it wasn't a coy. Yeah, listen. No, listen. I understand, but you need to talk to Anthony about that. Calm down. Yes, I understand. I'm sure we can come to some arrangement, but you really need to talk to Anthony. He's the man with the papers. Listen, you know who I am, who my grandmother is, was, right? Just relax. It'll be fine. You'll get your returns. Don't worry. Give Anthony a call, okay? Someone took out the VIP! Please, someone help me! <laughs> I just didn't like him. <laughs> Someone just wrote in chat comedy game. Yeah, pretty much. Hang on, I think I've got a little bit more comedy left. Where where is uh where's her corpse? It's a hell of a uniform you got. Gay. On top of everything, Rosie thinks she's in love with young Patrick. I mean, that's a uh -oh. heart. 
one body is normal. That happens every day. But two bodies, that's a coincidence. Chat, you seen any corpses around here? They might have moved her body. But did anyone even see it? I don't I don't think anyone's really aware of it. Did you give the Fitzpatrick token to Madame Carlyle's daughter? Rebecca? Yeah. Sorry, I don't think I know you, mister. Hold it right there. Where is this guy? <laughs> Where is this guy? Wait, the constant shit? Oh man. Who's my little diaper constant? Well, that was a clown mission. There actually is a clown mask. What is that? new lockpick there's a clown outfit to unlock how do you unlock the clown outfit stream on twitch says a chat member <laughs> find and equip all disguises in the manor oh okay You, you skip the story. Can I? I can view that next time, right? It's gone forever. No, really. How do you view the story? What do you do? This one? Even though I said ver at the very beginning, I don't care about the story. 
It's under the campaign tab. You have to go back to the menu now. Okay. Well, let's do it now. That way we can see it and then. Oh, it's this one. Okay. You know what? Next time. Next time I play it, I'll check that out. There's a mission or escalation in Paris that involves a clown. How to unlock clown outfit in Hitman 3. Unlocked via purchase of either the game of the year edition or the definitive edition. Hmm? Uh, shit. You gotta buy it. Purchase of game of the year edition or definitive edition. Do I not have the fucking clown? I thought I had the clown fit. And I guess I don't have that stuff. I have this Vin Diesel stuff, but the clown mission is DLC. The outfit is unlocked by beating it. Look for the challenges in Paris. Get access? Does that mean I don't have it yet? Do I not get the Paris mission when the game combines? I think I get it when the game goes to World of Assassination, whatever the fuck that means. It's such a clunky title, but I don't have Hitman 1 content. Eventually I will. If I'm still playing this when that happens, I can become the clown maybe. All right, that's really all I need to do is become Clown 47. I'll be happy. Well, I enjoy playing this game. Again, there are many ways to go about the missions, and I know some of the ways I go about them are kind of dumb, but I enjoy playing it. I hope you enjoy watching it as much as I enjoy playing it. How many times can I say enjoy before I do a BRB? Oh, one more time. Here's a song I enjoy. Up next is Bayonetta 3, and here is... I, I gotta stop using this BRB. And, and here is a song.